morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Monday. It is Monday. Let's make some coffee. You know what? I think I, I'm still missing the new Disneyland Starbucks mug, AJ. Yeah? I think so. I think I only have the DCA one, which is this one. This one. Okay, well, we're going to use this DCA mug today. And I just realized I never picked up the new Disneyland mug. Do they even still have that? Because I feel like it's been out. It's like old now. <laughs> I'm kind of in the mood for a little cinnamon in my coffee. So I'm going to put a little bit um, like that much in the bottom of my mug. And I am making hot coffee today. Should I actually just brew a full pot? Okay, you know what, actually, yeah, let's just make a full pot and then we'll come back once this is ready. Okay, and I'm not gonna put cinnamon in the grounds just because I don't know if I would want it every day. But then I can't have it like once it's cold because like it doesn't dissolve. Should I just put it in there? That's the question. Okay, you know what? Let's just do it. We're gonna put cinnamon in the grounds. Not too much. So I dumped all the whatever I ha had in my mug and then I added just a little bit more. Look at this super cute bobblehead that we got. We actually got this on Mercari. So this is from D23 Day at the Angels game. Um, it's a Mickey Mouse Angels bobblehead. Oh gosh. It's like hard to see with the glare. Um, but this game was on August 4th, which was the day we were driving back from Vegas. And I really wanted to go to the game to get this bobblehead. But we were like, no, let's not do that. Because we would have to like leave super early and then rush to the game because it started at 1. Um, and we just didn't want to do all that. So we found this on Mercari for $20. So we spent less than if we would actually have like gone to the game. <laughs> but yeah, he's so cute. Okay, let's see if I can give you a better look at Mickey. And then it says D23 day, August 4th, 2024, Mickey Mouse bobblehead. So cute. And he's on a stand. Okay, guys, coffee is ready. Same mug. I just rinsed it out. Because the cinnamon. The cinnamon... It smells so good. Oh my god. Put a little bit more. It smells like fall. Who's ready? Are you ready for fall? Woo! I am ready. Bring it on. And then for creamer, I'm just using the same one. It's the sugar free Italian sweet cream. That's so good. I put the I put the perfect amount of cinnamon in there. That is delicious. So good. Yesterday we went to H Mart and what did we get at H Mart? Oh, we went there to buy kimchi. The day before when we ate at Miss Shabu, we actually went to the there was a Asian store next door. And we went into there and I bought the, I bought daigu, which is like the pickled radish. Because I wanted to make daigu here at home. So we bought that and we had it in our fridge at the hotel. And so I was kind of worried because we were going to downtown Disney and that has to be refrigerated. So we actually got one of those just like foam coolers from the gas station. So we put the daigu in the foam cooler. Since we had the cooler, we were like, oh, let's go to H Mart and get some kimchi. So we were able to get kimchi. So today we're going to make some daigu. And I'm going to add cucumber. It's going to be cucumber daigu. And then I also got kimchi base to add to that. I've never added this before, but I'm pretty sure Red Rice makes their daigu with kimchi base. And I really like how it tastes. So we're going to try that later today. Yeah, that's the plan. We're going to make that today. We're at Dessert Anatomy. Let's go inside.
Just in case if y'all wondering what Ube is, you can pause right here. Tell you all to tell you all about it. One eternity later. Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. It is 8.35 right now and I'm, I'm about to make my coffee. Also, I'm still in my pajamas. I think it's going to be a pajama kind of day. So yeah, pajamas and messy hair. Anyways, you guys, I'm going to use this travel mug today. And then I have my coffee here that I made the other day. This coffee has cinnamon grounds in it, or like when I brewed it, I put cinnamon in the grounds. So it's a little bit, you know, cinnamon flavor. So when I go to Dutch Bros, I usually get a Kokomo, which is a coconut mocha. And that has been my go-to for a little while now. Like that is my favorite. And I really miss that. I wanna try to make it at home. Um, but they make it with espresso, chocolate milk, and then coconut syrup. So I'm thinking like, because obviously I don't like make espresso at home. I just make regular coffee. I wonder, because there is a coconut cream, a coconut creamer. I wonder if I would like that or if I should just get coconut syrup and then chocolate milk. Or should I use like chocolate syrup? Because if I use the creamer, that's already sweet. Chocolate milk is already sweet too. Oh my gosh, I don't know. <laughs> But I want to try to like recreate it at home. I don't know you guys. I just, I'm worried that like what if I don't like the coconut creamer. I saw that at the grocery store the other day. Yum. Let me know if you have any suggestions. How do you think I should recreate this Kokomo at home? I have to go to work. I have a ton of phone calls to make, so I will talk to you guys later. We're going to make some more cucumber daigu. I made this the other day, so it's basically the yellow radish cucumber, and then I add kimchi base, um, some vinegar, and a little bit of sugar. I'm using these Persian cucumbers because this is what they had when we went to H Mart, but you know, you can use any cucumber. Okay, and then I'm just slicing these into circles. But if I had like the regular cucumbers, I would probably cut it in half. So I did two of the cucumbers. And then this is the yellow pickled radish. So one of these. And then for this, I do half circles. And then this is the kimchi base. So we're just gonna add some of this. Just regular white vinegar. A little bit of sugar. Mix it up. Gonna add a little bit more the kimchi and just basically make it to taste so that's what it looks like let's give it a try delicious this is so cute you guys he got this little bike from his ninong pono do you love it do you love it do you love it yeah he likes this, the propeller, because you guys know he loves fans. <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> he doesn't walk yet though, so he can't like, he doesn't walk on it yet, but he likes to sit on it and play. Yay! Yeah. Say thank you, I love it! <laughs> yeah! And it's Mickey. Say, we have some shout outs today! <laughs> Shout out. Okay, first it's Uncle Chris's birthday. Yeah, say happy birthday, Uncle Chris. Happy Hello. birthday, happy Chris. Birthday. We're a little we bit late, you. but 
Better um, late than never. Go ahead, Papa. All the blessings to you, brother. And uh, ah! many, many <laughs> more years to come, man. Say happy birthday, Uncle Chris. Happy birthday, Chris. Happy birthday. Yay. Yay. Okay, and then we have another birthday shout out for Manuel. Say happy Say, birthday, Manuel. Happy birthday, Manuel. Ah, happy birthday. I think he's 22. <laughs> deuce, deuce. 22? I'm, I think, I'm not sure. Oh. I'm pretty sure. Say happy birthday. Okay, and then we have an anniversary shout out for Jason and Chelsea. It's their 17th anniversary. 17. Yeah. Happy anniversary, guys. Oh. Many more years mm -hmm. to come. All the love and blessings yeah. to you guys. Yes. And, um, keep it rocking. Happy anniversary, guys. <laughs> we have one more. <laughs> Is that you? Okay. Shout out to the Atencio family, Tina and Ron. <laughs> Tina and Ron Atencio. Shout out to you guys. Shout out. Thank, Thank you, you guys, guys for watching us. And um, big shout out to you guys. I actually had a friend, rest his soul. His name was uh, Robert Atencio. We called him Bobby. Aww. And um, yeah, he recently passed a couple of years. I think last year or the year before. But um, yeah, so shout out to you guys, the Atencio shout family. Out. Thank you guys for watching. And happy birthday again, Chris and Manuel. And congratulations, Chelsea and Jason. Happy anniversary. Yeah. And happy birthdays. And a big shout out to you. Thank everybody. you, guys. Love you. Bye.